An alert for anyone planning a trip to the mountains to see the leaves change. The Blue Ridge Parkway is issuing caution for increased bear activity. The Parkway's website says there has been a heavy presence of bears in the area. It also says if you see a bear, stay watchful and do not approach it. And if the bear changes its behavior near you, you're probably too close. NBC Charlotte's Richard Devane is live at six and Richard, we've seen a number of bear encounters in the past few weeks, so you better be careful out there. <laughs> Absolutely correct. I've been looking over my shoulder, but you know, you come out into the woods, the national parks, you want to enjoy the beauty around, but it's also important to be close, pay close attention to what surrounds you. Videos like this one of a bear that managed to get into an Asheville family's van can be funny, but sometimes coming into contact with one is nothing to laugh at. This is a really critical time for them to get out there and find spring food. In Tennessee, state park officials say they found an aggressive bear near the body of a 30 year old who went in the woods looking for ginseng. Officials have not yet said what they believe is the cause of the death. Now, the Blue Ridge Parkway has issued a caution for visitors of increased bear activity. Its website says bears are very active along the parkway at this time. A federal regulation rules that willfully approaching a bear within 150 feet or any distance that disturbs or displaces a bear is illegal in the park and just plain unsafe. We remind everyone to keep at least 50 yards between themselves and the bears to allow the bears space to pass um, and also so that they are not disrupted in their feeding behavior. Yeah, you want to be very careful about that. If a bear starts moving towards you, they say do not play dead and lay down. The best thing is to walk away slowly backwards, keeping the line of sight on the bear. And as you said, Sarah, move. If it changes directions or follows you, you try to change directions. And if all possible and that bear starts coming towards you, try and find anything you can, pots or pans or a big stick to try to ward, ward that bear off. And most importantly, just pay attention to your surroundings. If you see a bear, start to move away. Reporting live, this is Richard Devane. We'll send it back to you. Something you want to prepare for, but you hope never happens. Richard, thank you. Yeah.